Now there are some more points that we need to consider while uh, working with test classes or with unit test methods. Let's see what they are. Classes and methods defined as is test can either be private or public exactly as I explained earlier. The access level of the test methods doesn't matter. This means you don't need to add any access modifier when defining test class or test methods. The default access level in Apex is private. The testing framework can always find the test methods and execute them regardless of their access level. So like let's think about from where we need to execute the unit test methods from the testing framework which is provided by Apex itself. So this testing framework will any which way find out the unit tests written inside a test class uh, which is nothing but a class annotated with at is test annotation. It will automatically find all the unit tests irrespective of the access modifier that you have attached with it or that might be public or private or whatever you want to add uh, with it. And uh, the reason is uh, one more uh, because we do not call these test classes from somewhere else. If we need to call these test methods or something like that from some other class then in that case access modifiers matter. But if you're just calling it from the testing framework, you can find it any which way, irrespective of uh, the access modifier, then you do not have to even write down anything as an access modifier before uh, the declaration or with the declaration of a unit test method. You just need to annotate it with at is test annotation. Next, classes defined at as uh, classes defined as is test must be top level classes and can't be interfaces or enums. Again, a class, like a test class uh, or a class which is defined, uh, can, uh, you can add at is test annotation with only a class, not with an interface or an enum. Right, that's what it is. Next, a methods of test class can only be called from a running test. That is a test method uh, or code invoked by a test method can't be called from a non-test request. So let's take an example of the classes that we just created and uh, for the, just created the calculate class and uh, the test class that we created to test that calculate class, which is test calculate. So if we want to call any method of calculate from test calculate, we can do that. But the vice versa is not possible. So if you want to uh, call a test method from a non-test method, that is not possible. You can only call a test method from another test context or yeah, from another test method. That's what the case is.